I need to take a really, really quick shower right now. I need to wash my hair and I need to iron it and we need to go because I got to get the kids to their appointment for their haircut and we got to do that today. Five different pairs of shorts that are just like this some are longer some are shorter and then I have like a bunch of different sports bra because I thought for nursing would be perfect but yeah if I keep looking the same it's I promise you it's because one I do laundry and two because I have the same outfit like a thousand times I told you guys I would be living in <laughs> clothes like these but anyways I'm gonna go make something to eat because I am starving and that place for the kids haircut um opens at 10 so we have like 30 minutes to spare i want to be one of the first ones there because i want to get out quick and i want nobody to judge me for my screaming kids and they always scream when we go in there so also we have to choose what haircuts they're gonna get because i have no idea i want something short but not too short and so we have to see anyways let's go make some breakfast so for this Mother's Day weekend, we're not really planning much. We're just gonna go to Miami. We, we're gonna go see my mom and obviously stay with my boyfriend's mom. I should actually start packing our clothes today. I'm just gonna make a bagel. That's all I want. And the kids ate cereal, so. Ooh, I could also eat cereal. I don't know. <laughs> and lately this has been my craving, bagel and Cheetos. So the kids are dressed and ready to go. It's about to be like 10.30, dear Lord. Um, I have to do something about this hair before we go. Oh, okay. I'm gonna do something. I hate having hair wet like this, like damped. Oh my God, really hate it really hate it man i love using that shampoo and conditioner it literally leaves my hair so nice and smelling so good for so long i've always freaking loved that shampoo and conditioner my hair just accepts it and i love it my favorite part is that it's only a dollar <laughs> it's just so convenient and it works so well I think I did bangs for like a whole week and then after that I just stopped putting my hair in bangs. It's just my hair gets so itchy when it's damped, like my scalp. Let's go get a haircut. Excited? Yeah, my tired. Let me see your haircut, buddy. Let me see. Let me see. God, you look so awesome. You got lollipop for being a good boy. Let me see you, Lil. Oh, you look so awesome. Go show daddy right now. Yeah? Yeah. All right. Oh my God, I'm so uncomfortable. And it's so hot. It's 11.27. I spent like an hour in there. So this lady, she got mad and she like stormed out. She had two kids, one Oliver's age and another one, a little girl in a stroller. And she got mad because she was like 10 minutes after I came. So, and I was a walk-in. And she said that she called and they told her like to just go in. So I guess she was basically a uh, walk-in too. And then another person arrived after her and she got mad because there was two people ahead of me. And so they were doing it by like, 
you know, like whoever walks in first, whoever goes, and then another person had an appointment for 11, which I took because that person didn't come in. And she got mad because they attended us first. Like, she's like, no, I've been waiting like 30 minutes. I waited longer than that. And I didn't get mad. Like, girl, calm down. I don't know. But I was not going to leave this appointment. <laughs> we do it like maybe like three times a year, or twice a year, because it's just so hard for me to take the kids. And I was actually supposed to come with my boyfriend, but it just never ends up working out. They're always closed whenever he's off. So it's just hard to come here. But anyways, it's over. We're done. And I'm ready for Mother's Day weekend. I'm ready to get out of here. So let's go to my boyfriend's job and let's get some lunch. One eternity later. We just woke up from a nap. I gave the kids a bath because I needed to get their hair out of their face and stuff. But now we're gonna eat some ice cream and that actually sounds really good. I also need to start making dinner because it's like around five something. My boyfriend doesn't get out today till 9.30. So that kind of sucks because that means that I'm gonna have to put him to bed tonight alone. I literally don't know what the heck happens to my silverware. What happened it? What happened to our spoons? I don't know. <laughs> the, the spoons were thrown out. Went mommy. outside the house? Yep. I told mommy. Oliver, are you throwing away mommy's spoons in the trash? Yeah. Bruh. You are? Yeah. Why? Yeah. Okay, who said they wanted sprinkles? You both want sprinkles? What about chocolate? Anybody want a little bit of chocolate on top? Yeah, I want one. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, yummy. No, more chocolate. Turn it around like that. What? Now do it. Okay. Come on. No one's going to take it away. Just do it. Shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it. Shake the sprinkles. Don't put it too close. Just shake it like that. Yummy, that's a lot. Shake it, shake it, shake it. Oh my god, okay, that's a lot, that's a lot, that's a lot. Okay, okay, okay. I took a lot. <laughs> you put a lot on yours. Mommy, what's this thing? Ready, right here. Little child back there saying, You're welcome, Oliver. I'm like, what the heck did he do? Jax is trying to break out over there with his tongue. Oh my god, that's hilarious. He's literally trying to break out. Jax, I see you. So I used to buy the Hershey's, the flavor Hershey's ones because I was like, oh my God, Hershey's, melted Hershey's. Yes, we need that on our ice cream. But the one I started buying now is this one. It's called, it's from Magic Shell and it's the chocolate one. Um, and it freezes in seconds. So like it gets hard in seconds on top of your ice cream and it just makes it taste so much better. Add this with sprinkles and it's amazing. I don't know, it just makes it taste really good. So right now I'm just choosing some outfits for them to go to Miami in and just kind of hang out. We're only gonna be there for like a day and a half, maybe two days. idea of what to wear for Mother's Day so I have these two gorgeous blouses so these are beautiful and I really want to give them a try especially for Mother's Day so I don't know which to choose I'm just gonna take them both and decide over there I literally just got a glimpse of myself <laughs> really unsatisfying glimpse of myself I'm like girly what are we going through right now look at that you can Beep the belly all I have left to do is just iron my hair probably there's gonna be a Mother's Day vlog Probably not. I don't know. So later that day, I was laying down and I started noticing some really hard and uncomfortable baby movements. And so I really wanted to get it on camera and I started recording. You can see that bump right there. And held there and then slowly a little hand kept creeping in my video. And that was Oliver's hand. And once Leo noticed that I was trying to feel the baby, he 
was very interested in also feeling the baby which he has never really done and so they just started rubbing on my stomach and i thought it was the cutest little thing ever and his reaction to feeling the baby move and actually kick was just priceless do you feel it I look right here right here okay he's right here right now hold on you gotta be very still okay and he's in a kick watch it's so cool <laughs> oh my god hold on hold on ready hold on let's see baby baby can you kick for Leo really fast oh my god hold on baby Let's see, do you feel it? Yeah, mom. Oh, look, right here, right here. I felt him right here. You feel it? Yeah, my boy. Yeah? Where are you, baby? <laughs> Where are you, baby? You feel that? You felt it? I love it. Yeah. Hey, 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 careful, careful, careful. Mm -hmm. Look right there. He just kicked back. He's like, hey. Do you see it? Do you feel it? Mm. I feel it. You felt it? Yeah. That was a really strong kick. <laughs> Keeps moving. It moves out. Is that it? You felt it right there? Yeah. Oh my god. That's <laughs> it's kicking. It's kicking. <laughs> oh my god. So it's the next day. The kids yesterday actually felt my 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 belly for the first time. Like the movements, the baby's movements for the first time, and I thought that was so freaking cool. They they were like so excited about it. It was so cute. It was so funny. Their reaction, mainly Leo's reaction, was hilarious. He actually felt the baby kicking. This baby has been kicking and just moving and just moving things in there. Like I don't even know how to explain it. But yeah, the kids felt the baby for the first time. And my boyfriend, he keeps saying that he has a name. And he's trying to get the kids to repeat after him. So I'm kind of like... In a little I don't want to say battle with him but like I'm really trying to get the kids to not say that name because I just don't love the name I mean not yet I don't see it as like the baby's name I, I don't know I just don't feel I'm not feeling it yet so maybe it'll grow on me maybe not but for right now he keeps calling the baby Michael I don't know I just I want to like a really kind of like a half Hispanic half American name just so that way like when I get mad I can just be like Leonardo, you know, like in Spanish with my accent and stuff, or like Oliver, you know, like something easy to say. Okay, my goal in Spanish is Miguel, so like I don't know if it sounds the same. I mean, I like Miguel, but I don't like Michael, and he wants to name the baby Michael. I don't know. Oliver says it kind of funny, he repeated it once and he said it really funny and really cute. So I don't know if I'm gonna change my mind or not, but that's like the name that we're debating right now. I don't know, I always like Mattel for this baby, but like I don't, I liked it but I didn't love it, you know what I mean? So yeah, that's like kind of the argument because he doesn't like that name. So we're like back and forth, but I guess those are like our top two names. I don't know what we're gonna do but whatever we do my plan is to keep vlogging i don't know if you guys have noticed but i've been trying to daily vlog until i give birth and really record this pregnancy because i know this is going to be my last pregnancy so i'm really trying to record all the baby bumps record all our like record our life as much as possible because it's about to change three is a big game changer and i just want to capture as much memories with the kids right now as they are even though i'm not doing a lot with them as much as i want to be it's just i feel like i can't sometimes but i'm still trying to make like fun memories with them and i'm trying to you know see our life before 
another one jumps in when i was pregnant with oliver i feel like i didn't take advantage of that I'm, i look back at my videos and it's more like sit down videos and i feel like those are kind of boring so like looking back and seeing my bump and me going to the store with them or like going to the park with them and just i just feel like that's just a whole thing by itself like a whole memory thing and i just i prefer that so i'm trying to do that as much as possible and that's why i've been uploading a lot more and i'm very glad i've been trying to stay consistent so i'm very glad about that but yeah that's pretty much everything i had to say i hope you guys enjoyed i'll see you guys next vlog bye